Hello everyone. Uh, let's uh, take a look at the trade I made for um, a go a crude today. So uh, CL um, crude oil, and um, today is uh, December twenty ninth, two thousand twenty one. It is a Wednesday. So it was actually a really discouraging um, day for me in in crude because I left so much money on the table. It is crazy, and um, why? <clears throat> Just because uh, I didn't follow the rule. I didn't. I didn't stick on the trades, and uh, so let's uh, let's uh, look at what happened. So uh, today, uh, EA, EA, um, the the inventory for crude was at ten thirty. So no trades uh, for uh, crudes before. So. 8.30 came, there was a little bit of break right here, uh, so this one could have been a good trade on the break off of that uh, a high. Uh, if, you, if you see what happened in, in, at night or during the overnight, the market was moving down from this high here, moving down, 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 uh, right all the way through uh, 75.36 level. So if you see um, the 30 minutes chart, you know it was pointing to the downside. Uh, all moving averages are are stacking to the to the downside except for the 200 right here. But every everything else was um, was um, moving to the to the downside. And then there was a little bit of you know channel in these uh, three candles, and then moved to the upside, right there. So that one there is a would would have been a good trade. As a breakout, then uh, market kept moving, um, you know, sideways. Uh, you see, uh, moving averages are almost horizontally very close to the um, middle of the, um, uh, in between the pivot level and the and the support one um, level right here. So this one is the middle in between the uh, the um, the uh, uh, support one. Let me see where it is. Support one is right here, and the pivot is, I believe it's uh, somewhere there. Anyways, so um, so um, market kept moving to the to the sideways, and then um, the market, uh, the regular hours uh, for the market open. No trades here everything looks horizontal so no trades no trades this is a chop zone um so nothing there and then 10 a.m came came back we're waiting for 10 30. so moving down moving up channel 10 20 come here there was an indication that it was going to start moving up this one was a nice move pre-announcement and then let me go and uh, and then came back down and then <clears throat> announcement came back down make, made this up down up down and then uh, the market came bullish so this is where i took the trade right there uh 10 31 uh, 10 31 36. so that one there was good for one two three four five candles so 300 I, i'm sorry 200 dollars on the on the target so two contracts and then what it did came back and and took my stop for the second one at break even Okay, so two hundred dollars break even. It was kind of actually break even. I I, I I normally put it break even plus one, but this time I I put break even. And what it did was to keep going. And this is where I didn't enter. So this one was a really valid enter, ent entry, and I didn't take it. This one, 
and 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 I didn't take it uh, why because I already met my target for the day. I was uh, at seven hundred and twenty dollars. This was going to be my last trade, and I thought when I when I look at this, uh, let's uh, look at uh, at it. So look at this big juicy green candle right there and then it reversed all the way back down so previous high i was looking at this target the previous day high you know if they if they i i had all the sensation feeling that it was going to go all the way up there but i didn't take the trade so um let me get uh, there so that one would have been a really good trade then came back down if you took took this one this one would be one two three four five another one another 100 uh, 200 dollars there and then here another 200 dollars plus this runner uh, probably another i don't know 500 700 dollars i'm not gonna count but i didn't i didn't take it so then market started to collapse, right? It came down here. Down, down. There's nothing to do in this area here. This one, you can argue that you could, you, you should have taken. And then this one, you have been stopped out probably at that zero or break even because there's one, two, three, four, you know, five, maybe a target. And then um, came back down nothing to do in this one you are in the cloud breaking up here this one could probably be in a a loss uh small loss and then this one here if you took that one or this break break as well this one is another another uh trade another trade another trade another trade well, it depends on how you take it, right? If you take, um, if you take uh, um, weeks out of the moving averages, then yes, I mean this is insane, a lot of profit here. And then the market moved sideways, but then two candles for about an hour, and then at one p.m move to the upside again um, by noon right lunch time and then move up all the way up here and then it started to move sideways and that is how it finished so man oh man you know thinking that uh, that i just took one trade in crude today and that little thing there Thingy two hundred dollars when it could have been, you know, a good profit there. Um, well, I was at my target already. Seven hundred and twenty dollars is what I made today. Um, not bad, but uh, could have been way much better. All right, thank you for watching.